everybody welcome back to my channel and hello if you're new today i'm just gonna do another vintage kawaii haul toy haul for you guys i'm gonna go ahead and go grab the things i want to show you i guess i actually have two things here so i guess i'll go ahead and show you guys those first also remember to hit that subscribe button check out my instagram p.o box twitter ebay all the stuff down below and don't forget to check out any of my other videos if you want to after watching this one and yeah let's go ahead and get started so got my water we got my real Akuma water cup. Look how cute. I loved it. Okay, so here's the first two things I got, and then I'm going to go get the other things. So the first two things I got um, was thrifting a while back. I went to just a thrift store, and usually I found a lot of cool stuff at this thrift store. Maybe I'll go later today. I didn't find much because it was on the weekend. But anyways, I found both Erica and Annalise in Barbie the movie Princess and the Popper from the thrift store together, the little ones. When I was little, I had the miniature Annalise. My aunt gave it to me. I loved it so much, and then I eventually got rid of it, and I missed it, and luckily I found both Erica and Annalise. So yeah, I'm gonna go grab the other stuff. I'll be right back. I want to see the rest of the finds I got at the flea market. Let's get started. Have you subscribed yet? Love it if you subscribe. So here's what we got in my flea market bag. I guess we'll start with this. Got this My Little Pony Baby. She looks nasty as heck, but I got her for a dollar. I never really liked the G3 or the My Little Pony Babies. I'm like, they're weird, but this one just is really sweet and cute. It's got adorable embroidery. Very kawaii. Yeah, so there's that. So cute. Do you other pony collectors collect the pony babies? Let me know in the comments below. And then we got this thing. I've seen this thing. All over everyone looking at like 90s Polly Pocket um things. Yeah. All over everyone looking at 90s Polly Pocket toys. Sometimes I stumble upon this and I saw it at the flea market. Look at this. It's the toy carousel from 1999. Uh, I think from Moose Toys. Does not work. It's a toy jewelry box. It's barely been used. Look at it. It's still like shiny and new. It's so pretty. It's got all these little horses, so pastel, so fairy key princess kawaii. Uh, if I can open it, let's not break a toy. Oh, <laughs> I just smelled it. I know, gross, but it smells new and it still came with a little instruction thing with it. And it says, do not overwind carousel. And I'm like, well, yeah. So does anyone know how to fix these? Please let me know in the comments below because it is quite something. Got this for about seven bucks. Super cute. Put its little sticky lid back on. Prima just rested his head on my feet. Hold on, where's my cell phone? I love to downstairs so I can't check you guys. But he's so cute. And this is sticky. Ugh. I got the most exciting thing. The thing you probably clicked on this video for. And that is this juicy couture bag. I don't know if it's real or not, but I got it for five dollars. This is such a steal. This juicy couture holographic bag. It still had the Coles tag on it, so it must be real. It has the little crowns and everything inside. So yeah, that was a really good steal. We only went through the flea market in the evening when everybody was closing up and I just happened to see it and you know I go for anything pink especially purses because pink is fabulous and powerful. Yeah there's that. I don't know how to clean it either. Tell me how I, you think I should clean this down below. What a good flea market run. So yeah. I love you guys. Remember to subscribe. Tell your friends about me. Uh, if you they like kawaii too because suddenly I mean when I started this channel kawaii was not that big of a deal and now suddenly kawaii is huge and Sanrio stuff is like going way up in price and all this stuff like what? And and wait, before I go, I forgot to show you guys something. I got this little trinket box at the flea market too. I got it for a dollar. I just cleaned it. It's got these beautiful flowers on it. And obviously it was hand painted by someone. Tried to look it up. I couldn't find it online. It was just a cool little porcelain trinket box. So yeah, that's that. And it's really cute. And that's probably an annoying sound, sorry. <laughs> it also has this detailing on the side like these. I am so tired. I don't know why I'm tired. I'm just always exhausted. Like, I don't know. But anyway, yeah, there's that. And now I guess on to the outro. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Please remember to hit that subscribe button. Check out my Instagram, PO Box, eBay, all the stuff down below. If you enjoyed this cute early 2000s thrift haul of the super cute bag I got and all these little things. And yeah, I will be cleaning a lot of those. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed. Just remember to hit that subscribe button. Check out any of my other videos if you want to. Yes, this frame fell off the door. I still need to hang it. It keeps falling and it broke things. So yeah, that's why it is now on the floor. Look, it is currently on the floor there. So yeah, there's that. But anyway, thanks for watching. I will see you guys later. Okay, love you guys. Bye.